everybody. So right now I want to make a video about how you can help your children to learn math. So this is what we do over here. So I have some flashcards over here, but if you don't have them, I bought this one in Target. These ones are uh, counting from 0 to 25 flashcards. But of course now everybody's indoors. What you can do is that if you have post-its, you can print the numbers here. You can trace the numbers here. Look, these are post-its. Or if you don't have that, it's okay. You just got little pieces of paper and then trace the numbers like this. Just try to make it a little big like this, okay, so that your kids can see. So first, the most important thing is that your kid knows the numbers, knows what number is this. If you show your child this number, he says one, okay, this is perfect. And then, and then if you show this number to your child and he says number two, this is perfect. This is good. But how do you make your child understand that this is one? So you can use different objects. Like um, right now I have some pennies. I know some of you have pennies. You can disinfect them now with this of the virus. You can clean them and then you can have them work with this. But just be careful. They put this in their mouth. You have to be working with them with this. If you can, if you think that your child is going to put this in their mouth, so don't use this because I have small things. Or I also use little papers like this, you see, but this was extra. So I crumble it and make a little bowl, and then you can use this. For example, this is number one, so you can. Number one, you tell them. Like this is number, what number do you think it is? If they don't know, so you say this is number one. Okay, so now so you give them this give them a group, and then you say, can you put one little uh, paper bowl over here, and then they are supposed to take just one and count one. one. So if you give them three, they're supposed to put three little paper bowls, one, two, three, right? And this is the way they know this is the number three, and I have to put three. One, two, three. If you tell them the number, then they have to put how many are over here, right? You also can use, now that we're talking about plants and seeds, you can use seeds. If you have beans, like I do, well, I do have it for two years or so, I think. It's been still good. <laughs> so you can have your child, you give them some beans, you give them a group, and then you tell them, that you only need three. I only need three. So you make them count. One, two, and three. Now you have the same. This picture represents the number three. Okay? So this is where you're going to teach them first. Okay? And then later I'm going to post another video about how you make addition for numbers. Bye-bye.